India is assisting Tanzania in the establishment of a mechanized infantry battalion. Defence Acquisition Council is all set to clear six Airbus C-295 based maritime multi-mission aircraft for Indian Coast Guard, nine Airbus C-295 based medium-range maritime reconnaissance aircraft for Indian Navy, and six upgraded Netra Mark 1A for the Indian Air Force. China's third aircraft carrier Fujian is gearing up for sea trials, which features three electromagnetic catapult tracks. The Indian cyber security sector repelled numerous cyber attack attempts on the G20 portal during the summit, and 16 lakh DDoS attacks per minute peaked at some point. Chinese scientists have developed a sophisticated electronic warfare weapon that possesses the capability to launch multiple focused beams of electromagnetic waves from a single antenna that will enable simultaneous targeting of various targets in the sky, sea or land. New Space Research and Technologies is spearheading the convergence of augmented reality virtual reality and large language model technologies to create a mixed reality ecosystem for aerospace maintenance. After proposing a groundbreaking transformation into the Indian Air and Space Force, the Air Force is looking at the development of co-orbital weapons, which are satellites equipped with explosives and laser-based directed energy weapons to neutralize enemy satellites or even ground-based targets. Countries like the US, Russia and China are already investing heavily in space-based military technologies, and now the Indian Air Force is seeking collaboration with the RDO and ISRO for the development of safe and effective co-orbital weapons. The DRDO has released a video of its year-end review that shows that the RDO has successfully test-fired the 8 km range extended range anti-submarine rocket from both naval warship and truck-mounted launcher. The DRDO has also completed 100 plus hours test of 600 horsepower engine for future infantry combat vehicle and has also fired the first prototype of the Datron 1500 horsepower engine for DRDO's futuristic main battle tank. The DRDO and Air Force have also completed the user trials of QRSAM, as well as firing trials of mounted gun system, and has also demonstrated swarm technologies for mine neutralization. The DRDO developed 6 km range very short range air defense system will be handed to the Indian Army for user trials by April. It features advanced uncooled imaging infrared seeker that can be easily mobilized for close air defense of vital assets against low altitude threats, both in the challenging terrain of high altitude areas and in the maritime domain. As per latest reports, the Archer NG Medium Altitude Long Endurance Drone will roll out in early 2024, and the first flight will be conducted by mid-2024. The Archer NG will be equipped with electro-optical sensors radar and electronic intelligence systems for intelligence surveillance target acquisition and reconnaissance missions, and will have four hardpoints to carry 300 kg of payload for strike missions. Today's Top 3 Comments Oh, my God.